Thanks for the introduction, Dr. Payne. So my name is Crystal Grosso, and I'm from Emerson College. And today I'm going to talk about organizational communication in the healthcare context, uh, specifically in the hospital setting. So this might be a bit basic for some of the great scholars in the room, but I thought to contextualize what I'm going to be speaking about, um, we should look at the basic levels of communication. Um, and as Paul actually just talked about, and I didn't prepare this having looked at the agenda, um, but pharma advertising is one example of mediated and uh, mass communication in the healthcare context. We also have things like interpersonal communication, which is between two people specifically uh, in the healthcare context, what's most often studied is that relationship between patients and providers. Um, and all of these are affected by technology and culture. What I'm particularly interested in is organizational communication. And um, what I tend to look at is, in a hospital specifically, how do uh, messages get transferred from the top, from the CEO, all the way down to the bottom, from the bottom up, and everything in between. And I think it's uh, extremely important in our current uh, healthcare environment. And uh, I think that I'll be able to prove that with uh, some examples and a, and a case study. Also, um, one reason that I'm, I'm interested in this field is there seems to be sort of a lack of research in this area. There's a lot on organizational communication in other settings, more uh, corporate settings. Uh, and then health communication tends to focus on interpersonal communication, uh, mediated mass communication. I think that uh, after this year, you're going to see a significant increase in public communication um, since the uh, Obama administration has done some very interesting things that I think uh, a lot of communication professionals won't want to take a look at. Um, and also small team and group communication. I found a lot of research about uh, how nursing units communicate and how they communicate with other departments at the hospital. Uh, but there's very little research on how the entire organization uh, has this sort of um, communication across all the departments and, uh, and an up and down communication between administrators, physicians, uh, mid-level mid managers, and uh, line-level employees. 